Wyndham Clark, six under 64, an absolutely fantastic round of golf, especially here in the afternoon. What did you see out of the, out of the course today? Um, you know, it wasn't, uh, it was pretty benign, to be honest. It, um, you know, tees were up, the pins weren't crazy tough, there wasn't that much wind, and then it wasn't that firm. Um, so if you hit it in the fairway, you had a you know, really good chance to make birdies on most of the holes. Um, I mean, if you missed fairways, it was still challenging. And, um, but yeah, I thought it was very gettable today. A lot of talk coming into the week about how players were going to approach number six. Can you just talk us through that hole? Yeah, uh, I mean, it's a fantastic hole. Um, you know, I think you can play it a bunch of different ways. I personally like going for it. Um, you know, I can see laying up as well. But yeah, today I, I went for it and was just short and uh, chipped it up and had a short little birdie putt. So, you know, it's a, it's a challenging hole. If you hit a great shot off the tee, it's pretty easy, but you can also get in some, some weird spots. What part of your game are you most proud of today? Probably, uh, probably my putting and my mental game. I, I didn't hit it all that great, um, you know, in the fairway. My iron game was a little, a little suspect, but I putted great. And then, you know, I, I had some bogeys out there and I followed every bogey up with a birdie. So I thought mentally I was great. Right here to Dylan. Do you feel any difference since your win? Um, not, I mean, a little bit, obviously, I, at least I know I can do it. And so when I'm playing, um, good golf and I have a chance to win, at least I got that monkey off my back. Um, but other than that, no, I mean, I've, I was playing great golf leading up to that and I've played good golf since. So, um, you know, it's obviously nice to win and, and it just breeds confidence. Coming into this week, did you have a sense that this could be a good fit for your game? Yeah, I did. I, I came in on Tuesday of last week, played practice round with a buddy of mine. And he showed me around and, you know, I felt like there was a lot of holes that fit my eye and I liked the greens and I love the design of the golf course, which usually I play good on courses where I feel comfortable and I like the design of it. Um, you know, and it, there's a lot of creativity out there. So if you if you get in trouble, there's some holes where you really got to be creative and have some fun. And I typically like doing that. So. When you shoot six under in a major, does it feel different than six under somewhere else? Yeah, I would say so. I mean, there's just, it's as much as you try not to make it any different from any other tournament, majors just have a little different buzz. Um, but yeah, I mean, six under in any major is usually really, really good, uh, especially US Open. So I'm happy with, happy with the round. When you show up on the property and two guys have shot eight under, even though you're told that this championship is maybe not built that way, does it change your thinking? Um, I mean, yeah, I mean a little bit, but at the same time, um, if you, in US Opens or any tournament, if you try to make birdies, especially US Open, like you try to force it, it's you're one shot away from making a double or start stringing along bogey. So, I mean, it's huge to just play, you know, get in, get in play and then be really smart into the greens. And then when you're on the greens, you can take advantage of it. And, you know, obviously I started out nicely and got on the right side of momentum and just kept the round going. Uh, weird one, but is there a particular shot on this property that freaks you out a little bit? Not particularly. I mean, obviously hole six coming into it, it's just a, a matter of how good you hit the shot and where you go. And it's, there's so much unknown because you might hit it where you want to, but then it could end up in a bad spot. But no, other than that, I, I feel really confident on the golf course. Last one for me is basically a podcast at this point. Um, did you say you got here last Tuesday? Yeah, uh, well, I played Tuesday. I live in Scottsdale, so I just flew over, okay. played 18 holes, and then flew back. I did not. I have not stayed here since. All right, got it. Yeah, I was yeah. just wondering how much yeah. mileage you'd put on yeah. here. Yeah, no. Yeah, I did not do that. Awesome. Thanks for your yep. time, Greg. Thank you.